Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is about tattoo aftercare. I'm just gonna talk about the method that has worked best for me. Just keep in mind that different people have different types of skin and the healing can be a little different. Right after you get a tattoo, it feels kind of like a sunburn. Totally fine, totally normal. I leave it covered for the first night. Sometimes that means it's eight hours, sometimes it's like 15 or 20 hours but I don't want to sleep with it uncovered. Then when I wake up in the morning, that's when I take the cover off and wash it for the first time. You might have a lot of color bleeding, which is another reason you wanna keep it covered overnight so you're not ruining all of your bed sheets. And just to be safe, if you don't know if the tattoo is gonna bleed a lot of color, don't plan on wearing anything nice for the first day. Then once the cover is off for the next two weeks, every single day, I wash it with antibacterial soap two or sometimes even three times a day. That might seem like a lot, especially because depending on the placement, that might be a pain to wash it that often, but you don't want it to get infected. So in my opinion, it's worth it to keep it as clean as possible. Then I let it scab over and let the skin kind of take care of itself. Whenever it starts to look really dry or really itchy, I apply a little bit of a mild lotion. Usually, I don't even put lotion on for the first day or two, and after that, maybe only twice a day, I just add a little lotion to it. Um, after the first four-ish days, it starts to peel and flake, which is normal, that's your skin taking care of itself, getting rid of the dead skin. Don't scratch it or pick the skin off. There are a couple basic rules for everyone's healing process, and that's one of them. Do not pick the dead skin because if you do that, what you're doing is taking off pieces of skin that aren't ready to come off yet, which could really impact the way that it heals. So don't do it. It's gonna be on your skin forever, so you want it to look good. Another rule is to not hang out in standing water with your tattoo, because there could be lots of icky stuff just hanging out in water, and you don't wanna soak an open wound in icky water. So that means no baths, pools, lakes, rivers, puddles, if you will. Don't do it. Yeah, pretty simple. Um, now I did twice try the method where I applied ointment while I was healing. Both times it just didn't heal very nice and I actually had to get it touched up, which is why I choose to use the method that I do. I just recently got a new tattoo and film part of the healing process so you might have a better idea of what I'm talking about. So let's check that out. Here's that tattoo a day later. So this is after I've taken the bandage off and given it a wash. It has a nice scab over it so it feels kind of bumpy and the overall sensation isn't very bad. This is about four days later when it starts to get kind of gross and peely. Ew, see that skin? That's the skin you just leave there until it's ready to come off. As I mentioned before, I just use a mild lotion to keep my skin moisturized and I choose lotion over ointment so that it can still breathe and heal nicely and I just kind of pat it on there instead of rubbing again so that I don't rip off any of the skin. After the two week period, this is my tattoo all healed up. And now that it's healed, you want to protect it from the sun and from fading and everything. So be sure to cover that tattoo with sunscreen when you go outside. Also, sunscreen is just good. Okay, cool. Quick side note, when you clean it, use a pump soap and not a bar soap. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you found this useful, give me a thumbs up. Check out the other videos I have on my channel and maybe even give me a subscribe. If you have used other methods, successes, failures, tips, anything, go ahead and leave that in the comments for us. If you're thinking about getting maybe your first tattoo and have questions or anything like that, you can also go ahead and leave that in the comments. 